It's fine. Today I'm going to be doing a Diamond Art Club unboxing. I purchased this kit from an individual um, because I think when this kit came out, although I loved it, and even when I'm not really diamond painting, I do kind of keep up with what is being released. I I did not buy it. I don't, it, it might have been, you know, a financial reason. It might have been it was too close to the wedding. There's a number of things that it could have been. Or it could have been too close to like Christmas or something or my son's birthday. But I just I just didn't get it. So when I realized it was discontinued and I bought its sort of counterpart, I went on a hunt for it and I was so lucky to find it the day that I posted in a cash group that I was looking for it. And I have Aphrodite by Chris Abug. And I'm so pleased. I have Aphrodite. Thank you so much, Crystal. I literally cannot thank you enough. Um, I'm just so pleased. I'm so blessed. <laughs> I bought Persephone when it came out, and I bought this one literally the same day. I think I bought them the same day. So, thank you, Crystal. Okay, so she did tell me that um, the toolkit was missing and she said I could send you a toolkit. I was like, girl, I don't care about the toolkit. I just wanted to make sure that the drills were still in there and the stickers. So sure enough, I have my stickers, both of them, the logbook sticker and the um, color stickers. And I am so pleased because I am just finishing up Cordon Babe and my God, <laughs> the depressing colors that that was. I cannot wait to get into and she's so pretty she's got tons of color blocking thank you thank you Aphrodite okay 35 colors um of which four are going to be AB looks like she didn't even open the drills and if she did girl you put them back perfectly so Aphrodite unfortunately is a discontinued kit um, but it is by Chris Abug, whose art is still uh, very prevalent on Diamond Art Club. A lot of beautiful artwork. Um, let me just roll this back a little bit so you can see the top part of the canvas because it's like perfectly curled so that you cannot see the flowers at the top and the flowers on the bottom. Tons of color blocking. So ready for this. Can't even. Okay, here we go. We've got uh, two bags of... 3865. Oh, you know what? I'm so excited. I didn't freaking. Hello, Earth to you. <laughs> Not on this planet. Two bags of uh, 3865. We've got. We've got uh, two bags. Oh, you know what? I am going to zoom in a little bit. Two bags of 819. 754, 1, 2, 3 bags of 141, uh, 37, 13, 156, 2 bags of 37, 47, 2 bags of 157, 2 bags of 38, 23, uh, 128, a soft pink AB, 778, 352, 793, 3771 and 150. Moving into the last strip, we have 353, 3354, 961, 3350, 554, 967, 129, which is a soft, soft, buttery yellow. 951, 119, which is a, a pretty vibrant purple. Um, I would say that that's probably a Equivalent to 208 AB. Um, 712, 3878, 741, 3746, 3836, 742, 341, 726, 356, and 898. Okay, so we had a purple, a pink, a butter yellow and white. So, um, we'll start with 141. That's the white one. I'm a little disappointed to say that the entire background is not four, um, but there are fours 
which, you know, honestly makes sense because when you pull away from it, if the whole thing was AB, it wouldn't really have anything. Is that my pop socket? Yeah. Sorry. I'm filming on my phone, y'all. Okay, so everywhere you see white in her dress and in her hair and in her cloak thing, that is going to be all of the uh, one for one. All this bit right here. So, okay, that's all right. That's good. Okay. I'll allow it. <laughs> And then the pink is going to be number two, and that is going to be in her hair. Um, yeah, it looks like it's going to be in her hair only. So just insorted, I mean, assorted parts of her hair, the softer pink parts here. And, oh, and in her cloak also. Um, next up is the purple one, and that is one. The symbol for that is one, so it's going to be sort of the outline of her dress. And in, like, deeper... Um, crevices of it and like again the outline and in her cloak as well and then finally the butter yellow which is one two nine and the symbol for that one is going to be three and it's going to be in her dress right here and the highlight on her skin again in her dress and in her skin highlight as well so it's it's definitely the yellow is more of a subtle look to it um I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do to spice this up though, because the white background. Oh, it's a round kit. Did I tell you that? God, I suck. It's a round 51 by 71. Dude, I was so excited. I hunted for this one. And while I was hunting, I found an, a, an unopened box from Diamond Art Club. I've got no idea what's in it. I sent it to my parents' address, which is even more strange. While I was looking for this kit, because I did not open it, because I knew that if I opened it, I was gonna start it. And that is exactly what I'm doing. I am finishing Cordon Babe this weekend. And I am kidding this one up today to go for Mermaids and Magic. And yeah, I think that this is... I can't I can't freaking wait, y'all. I can't freaking wait. I can't wait. Anyways, back to the story. I found an unopened box from Diamond Art Club under my couch. It got sent to my parents' house. Is there even a date on this box? I don't have a date on this box, which is disturbing. Oh, 12-16-21. That is when it got delivered. That is so gross. And it's been living under my couch. Um, and I've got no idea what's in it. So that's the next video that I'm going to film today. But anyways, let's conclude Aphrodite. Thank you so much, Crystal. I appreciate you. I'm so glad that you were willing to part with this kit because she is my next kit up. Thank you, Crystal. I am ready. I am also ready for Shay and Randy's event, Mermaids and Magic, in March. I have a mermaid coming from Enabler's Outpost, and she is magical. So um, she counts for magic, and then the mermaid will count for mermaid. And we'll see what other things I throw in the mix during the month. Um, because if I'm able to complete this one with all its color blocking, and the mermaid one from Enabler's Outpost with all of its color blocking, maybe I can get to one of the craftably ones that you saw me unbox, or that I haven't unboxed. I don't know when these videos are going up, but... I'm, I'm bulk filming you guys, which means that I am officially back at it, back at it again. So in the last couple days I had filmed, this is the third unboxing and I'm getting ready to open this diamond art club in a minute. So I'll have five, five unboxings. And then on the way to work, I'll probably film a whip and chat just to catch you up on my life. Cause I'm not going to allow myself to stop doing what I enjoy and what I love because of any other reason. So here we go. Aphrodite. She's next. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you like me and like to see more from me, please hit subscribe. I'd be so happy to have you. All right, I hope that you are being safe, washing your hands, taking care of yourselves. And I don't know if you can see him, but my baby cat is right there again. In every video, he wants to make an appearance because he's a special boy. So throw up an orange cat in the comments if you made it to this point in the video. Okay, thank you so much. Bye. That's a sweet boy. Look at him. Oh, God, he's so wonderful. All right, love you. Bye.